Chapter 3 is about input-output wiring. These are digital input and output modules. On the left-hand side are digital input modules, and on the right-hand side are digital output modules. Digital input module uses DC 24 voltage or AC 110 220 voltage. DC type has both source and sync type. Some modules can be used as both sync and source. Output modules are divided into transistor type, relay type, and SSR type, which is solid state relay. Transistor output module needs DC 24 voltage, where it has sync type and source type. Relay and SSR type receive AC power. Let's take a look at digital input. This is a sync type digital input module. For the sync type input module, the COM terminal, which is the common terminal for the PLC input module, is connected to the DC 0 volts in power source. The current flows from positive to negative, so the current flows into PLC when the switch connected to the PLC input is turned on. When you push the switch, the current enter flows into P0, and the number 0 bit becomes on. Remember that 0 voltage of SMPS is connected to COM. This is source type digital input module. The COM terminal for the source type input module is connected to the DC 24 voltage power source. This shows how the current flows from the PLC. So it is called the source type. This is sync type output module. For the sync type output module, the COM terminal of the PLC output module is connected to the DC 0 volts in power source. The only difference between sync type output module and input module is that output module needs a jumper. Positive terminal is connected to 24 voltage, just like this video. This is source type digital output module. The COM terminal for the source type output module is connected to the DC 24 voltage power source. Further details can be found in the user's manuals. I'll see you in the next lecture.